I'm Michaela Chester for NCAA.com, and these are the three volleyball matches I'm most looking forward to this week and why. First off, the number one team in the country, Baylor, is currently on a seven game sweep streak. So they're not only winning all of their games, but they're dominating them too. The Bears will play Iowa State on the road this Wednesday at 9 p.m. Eastern Time on ESPNU. The all-time series between these two teams is actually tied 24-24, but Baylor has won the last four. Iowa State is 11-4 this season and actually put up a good battle against Texas despite being down two starters. Yasiana Presley is still rolling for the Bears and she's currently leading the country with 5.97 kills per set. I'm excited to see if Baylor can continue their hot streak or if Iowa State can put up a fight. A bonus match I'm excited to check out Wednesday night too is Minnesota versus Illinois. I'm a little more excited to see the Gophers in a matchup I'll mention here in just a minute. Next up, Creighton versus Marquette on Saturday. These are two ranked teams that have some notable wins and could put on a pretty good volleyball match. They're currently tied at 4-0 at the top of the Big East standing, so the winner of this one will likely take the upper hand in the conference. Allie Barber is leading the Marquette offense by leaps and bounds with 279 kills this season. She accompanies that with a 285 hitting percentage. And for Creighton, you can expect to see Jayla Zimmerman and Keely Davis to lead their offense. Lastly, I'm super excited for Minnesota versus Wisconsin Sunday on Big Ten Network. The Badgers are on a crazy streak after upsetting the number two and number five team in the country last week. They made some statements, but Minnesota has a huge chance to make some this week too with two top 25 matches against Illinois and Wisconsin. The Gophers have some big wins over Stanford and Florida this season, but then they also have some losses early in the season to Florida State and Texas. Since those two losses though, they've won nine straight, so this week will give them a chance to move back up in the rankings and prove themselves as a big time contender. Stephanie Samity will have to do her thing. She's been putting up pretty numbers in the Gophers' last three wins. Wisconsin has developed into an all-around consistent team with threats now coming from everywhere, not just from six foot eight Dana Redkey. They outperformed a Nebraska team last week that was playing really well. If they can keep up that kind of consistency, they will be really hard to defend. So don't miss out on these top matchups this week and follow along on NCAA.com and NCAA Volleyball on social for everything you need to know.